Hi everyone, my name is Randy Biner, and I just found out yesterday about this great uh, challenge. It's called 10 Tips for 10 Days. And um, so someone tagged me and I figured I'll participate because I think I'm full of good information. And so what I wanted to do is just give you guys some insight into uh, some, some practices that I've been doing for over 20 years in some cases, and hopefully that will be helpful to you. So what I thought we'd do is have an overall theme of how to avoid regrets in life. And so what I thought I did is take uh, the lifespan from 20 to about 80 and think of the different stages in life and the potential challenges that we're facing with the goal to then not have any regrets at the end. So today, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna talk specifically about how to do a bucket list um, I'm not going to go into details, but I'll tell you the importance of doing a bucket list. And then in other days, we're going to talk about the moral compass, how to avoid a quarter life crisis, the best marriage advice ever, uh, important life decisions and how to make them, how to avoid the midlife crisis, the power of thank yous, and then we'll finish up with time posting. So, um, and this kind of builds on top of each other. So it'd be great if you could follow me every single day. And if not, uh, you can uh, so certainly watch the videos after. So today we're gonna talk about bucket list. So this is actually my bucket list. And I started this uh, on September 29th, 1994. So this is still the original binder and everything, yellow paper, notepad. Um, and so what I did is I realized that if I don't uh, follow my dreams, I'll never achieve them. If I don't know what my dreams are, I will never achieve them. So I put myself in the mindset of if I had unlimited time, unlimited money, to support of my family and no fear, what are some of the things I would want to do in my life? And so what I ended up doing is just taking a piece of paper and start writing. And it was a, a great exercise. And then after a while, I kept deleting, I added more stuff to the point where I have now 90 dreams that are on my bucket list and I've done about 44. So about half of them have been done. Everything from seeing the pyramids in Egypt to uh, snorkeling with a whale shark to uh, diving the barrier reef. So I've done some really cool things um, and I've been very blessed. Uh, so I wanna pass this knowledge on to you guys it's never too late to start a bucket list. It's just really important that you have one. Because again, what you don't want, you don't want to have any regrets when you're 80 and you don't have the time or the money or the health to do these things anymore. So um, I hope this is helpful. There's obviously a, a real technique on how to build a bucket list. Today, my message was just go today and start one. And if you want to learn more about the techniques, please message me directly. And I hope you'll tune in tomorrow when we talk about the moral compass. Thank you.